Parallel Winos Live. We're down here in Woodenville at Conversion Zone and uh, Patterson. John Patterson is about to actually uh, dump the bin over into the, uh, the hopper. We're going to let you see that. That's pretty cool. And then from there, show you how it goes into the press. So you got Kristen here and she's helping out with, yeah, what's up man? John, or Jack actually, old man Jack, there we go. Here we go, Grenache being dumped into the hopper. Scott's your money coming down right here. Look at that. Wow. That's beautiful. And from here, goes up, up the hopper. And all the way into the press. And then over the course of time, you'll see that the uh, the wine will get dumped off the bottom. Now this is red. We got some video earlier this week of uh, Sauvignon Blanc, so it'll be it'll be a little different to see this. Show you quickly what happens after this point. Oh, I'm gonna go up on the steps, you're right, good call. So we got the authorization to go up on the steps and take a look and see what happens. Right here, you can see the juice will eventually come out right here. But it's not doing it right now, so. Here we go, let's take a look. So I'm climbing up on top of the press and you can see right here, everything that's coming out from the hopper gets dumped into the inside of this press. Um, it's a bladder press, right? Okay, so the bladder press, you can see this white lining here. Uh, the grapes get shoved into uh, where the bladder is itself. And then when they rotate it, what'll happen is the bladder itself will actually fill itself up with compressed air or something like that, I think. Whatever the hell they use. And, um, It'll just squeeze. It'll squeeze these. It'll squeeze this. You know? And these are, I mean, these are just grapes. Grenache. Welcome to Grenache. Pretty cool, Washington State Grenache. I'm getting dirty. You know what? It's harvest. I can clean myself up. Pretty cool, pretty cool. A little Tempranillo left over in this stuff too. So it's gonna be Grenache and a little Tempranillo grapes. But they're pretty much all dried up. Anyhow, we're going to get back to you a little bit later on, and uh, I'll film it out when it starts crushing.